And now on to our dinosaur of the day, Bahariasaurus, which was a request from Pezshet via YouTube. Hopefully I pronounced that correctly. The name means Baharia lizard, and the type species is Bahariasaurus ingens. It was described in 1934 by Ernst Stromer, and the holotype consisted of two dorsal vertebrae, a neural arch, sacral vertebrae, a rib fragment, and other fragments. The type specimen was destroyed in World War II. It's not clear exactly how to classify it, but it's been assigned to a few theropod groups. In 1995, Oliver Raut compared Carcharodontosaurus and Bahariasaurus to Ceratosaurus, Torvisauridae, Tyrannosauridae, Salurosauridae, and Allosauroida, based on data that Stromer published in 1931, 1934, and 1936. Stromer named a new family in 1931, for Carcharodontosaurus, and he thought that both Carcharodontosaurus and Bahariasaurus were theropods, but not closely related. In 1960, the parent classified Bahariasaurus as a megalosaurid, and others agreed over the years, though in 1990, Molnar and others said it was Carnosauria in Certesidus, uncertain placement, and that Carnosauria consisted of Allosauridae and Tyrannosauridae. In 1991, Bonaparte said that it was more closely related to Abelosauridae and Noasauridae, but Raoult thought that Carcharodontosaurus and Bahariasaurus were closely related because they had more plural souls in their caudal vertebrae, these hollow depressions to help decrease weight. So he referred both of them to Allosauroidea. And then in 2000, Churd suggested that it was Tyrannosauroidea. So again, not totally clear how to classify. All over the place, but mostly with big old meat-eating theropods. Yes. <laughs> It's also potentially synonymous with Deltadromaeus, a theropod that lived around the same time in North Africa and has been found in the same formations, but it's too hard to tell since Bahariasaurus remains have been destroyed. Because again, Ernst Stromer, basically everything that he found was destroyed in World War II. And we haven't found anything new? Of Bahariasaurus? Yeah. I don't believe so. Oh. If Bahariasaurus and Deltadromaeus are synonymous, though... That means Bahariasaurus slash Delta Dromaeus would have been large, estimated 26 feet or 8 meters long. But we need more specimens to know for sure and to classify Bahariasaurus. In 2016, it was suggested that Anoraptor, Bahariasaurus, and Delta Dromaeus could possibly be a not well known clade of Megaraptoran tyrannosauroids. But anyway, what we do know is that it was a large theropod that lived in the Cretaceous in what is now Egypt. <laughs> it was about the same size as Tyrannosaurus and Carcharodontosaurus, maybe. And it probably lived in the same time and place as Spinosaurus and Carcharodontosaurus, so that would have been an exciting time to live. Maybe terrifying. Too exciting. Yeah. <laughs> 